Hey guys, it's me, Woobers, and today we are back playing some more of The Walking Dead. In the last episode, we were able to save Glenn. Sure, we weren't able to save his little imaginary girlfriend, the girl he so badly wanted to romance. She ended up being bitten, and you know, you can you can like a girl, but when she's a zombie, it ain't the time. It's not good. You know, you don't want her to go in and start biting you. Yes, it's not what you want. But now we are back in the pharmacy, and we need to find the old man's medicine. But before we get into this video, guys, please make sure to leave a like and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And go ahead and ring that bell. That bell will notify you of when I post next. But with that, let's get into the game. Now our next order of business is going and getting the pills. Now where those are, I have no clue because when we were out there, nothing really changed. Did you have anything doing? important to say? If you don't mind, I think my family and I are going to rest for a bit. Let me okay. know if that asshole over there takes a turn for the worse. Here will do. Will do. I got you, bud. I know you don't like him too much. I'll take care of things. You know, I'll take him out back. And never mind. We ain't, ain't going to talk about that because it won't need that to happen. We'll be okay. All right, Clementine. Everything will be a okay. Oh, we have an axe now. Use axe on that pharmacy door. Okay. That's not going to work. What do you think that was going to do? What did you think that was gonna Jeez, do? Are on that zombie out on the street. Yeah. But is there anything else in the first aid kit? I thought we researched that. Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. Oh well, yeah, but whatever. I I could have sworn there was something else in here. I guess not. I guess I need to go back out there with that weird dude. The guy who's just kind of awkward. I don't know. I'm not sure how to handle this next. Maybe we can throw an axe at the guy? Can we go through here? Why can't we go in here? No, Glenn, you're fine. I don't need to talk to you, buddy. I don't need to talk to Carly, either. Let's go outside and talk to Doug. How hey, Doug. Good. How we doing? Want to go have a look around outside? Yeah, let's go have a look. Now that we have an axe, let's that have might a help. Look around. Okay. Maybe. I don't know. I'm not sure if we can axe anything. We can axe the lock. Yes. Okay. There we go. Awesome. Okay. Now to distract those things. How do we distract? Them? Uh, open gate latch. Those TVs are on, and I'm sure they're making a lot of noise behind okay. that glass. Did you guys try to get in there? Okay, we already, we already know this information. We already know it. it. But it was too risky. It was Not too a risky. Bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And well, what happened? They died. And they're most of who you see wandering around. <laughs> they're all dead. They're all gone. We don't need to worry about that. Let's open the gate. Okay. Hey Doug, you want to go out there and test the waters first? Yeah, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, Can we break a window? Work. I can't do anything else, can I? I can't look at him like that. Well, you can. You just did. Okay, how do I? How do I manage this? I don't know where to go. There shouldn't be anything else inside, right? I don't think there'd be anything else inside. But there's no actions that can play here. It's all just looking at things. And I can't move, so I guess... Oh, there we go. See, how is I supposed to see that? Like, how was I? And break. Just launch that over there. Go ahead and just be the QB. Go Joe Montana on it. Just go up. Ah, gone. Look at that throw. Look at that throw. Instead of teaching at UGA, you should have been throwing for UGA. Because they need a they need a quarterback. Sure, they won the national championship and all that, but no. Like, did they win? I don't know. I think they won. Yeah, they won. They won. They won. All right, make a sprint. Make a sprint. Be careful. 
keep an eye out, will you? Yeah, keep an eye out, Doug. Why are we walking? We should just be sprinting. The quicker we get over there and get things done, the better. Hi, brother. How are you? Don't touch me like that. Hey, stop. Hey, bud. Hey, bud. I don't know what happened. How's the whole zombie there? thing treating you? I know if you were there, you would have died for it. So, yeah. I'm gonna assume that's what happened. Okay. It's, in this case... Give me a second. Shut up, Doug. God. Stupid Doug. I'm sorry I wasn't here. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry I wasn't here. Yeah, it sucks that he wasn't able to leave his family. To take care of him, Bob. That helped. No. Oh, God. We gotta kill him? Oh. That's so rough. <sighs> Hit him again. Hit him again. Of course this game went less with the easy way out of this. One hit's not enough. We gotta completely sever the man's neck, don't we? Hit him again. Oh. I, we gotta keep going? God. If it wasn't emotional enough, we'd hit this man, what, four or five times? Oh, yeah, let's find the keys now. Let's search our dead brother's body. That's always fun. God. There we go. At least we got the keys, though. That old man better be happy. Holy he better crap. be happy. Run! If you didn't yell, Doug, they probably wouldn't be coming this way. You fool. You fool. Now we just lost... Ah, uh, we probably just lost this place because we broke the lock and it's not as fortified. God dang it. Man, that was close. Yeah, it was but close. We did it. It's all that matters. But we're not going to be able to stay here, most likely. Doug, you better stay back there. I like your shirt. <laughs> I like your shirt, Doug. Never mind. Great. That's going to be angry at you. God, you're amazing. Uh, I Let's know. get in there. I, I know I'm amazing. You, you. Don't got to fret on me, okay? I, we're good. We're all good. Come on, open it. Put the key in. Up oh, the wrong key. That sucks. Okay. Oh no. Shit. We gotta hurry. You gotta be kidding. You're kidding, right? You're kidding, right? Gosh. And the zombies are like, hey! That's a loud noise. Is that the dinner bell? <laughs> is it time to eat, Mama? Mama, is it time to eat? I'm hungry, Mama. I know, Mama. I'm coming. I'm coming, Mama. <laughs> is that a screwdriver in your back? Are you okay? You look a little, a little stiff. You look like you need to like unscrew it. Unscrew yourself. Oh, that's loud. Come on, maybe time to go. I'm gonna get the truck pulled up round back! Do it fast. I gotta get my dad out of here. I don't plan on dilly dallying. Honey, take Duck <laughs> to the alley. I don't plan on dilly dallying. Get the living hell out of the door behind me. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Stug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. All right. Hey, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. Right, I'm, I'm glad we took over. Oh, you gave it to you three, That's get on it. I'll get back as fast as I can. All right, all right. Stay away from the windows. Can I help? Okay, stay. If you don't make it through this, you should know that I think you're a great guy. Oh, thank you, Doug. We will make it through this. Thank you, Doug. Love you too, buddy. All right, close it. Hurry up. I should know what? Huh? Then I should know. God, Doug, this is all your fault. Oh God, don't you, Doug? Clementine, can you look for something to stick in between the handles? Something real strong, okay? Okay. All right, Clementine, go get something. Come on, Clementine, find me something quick. Did you find anything? Nothing. 
Oh my god, there's like a hole right there! Now we got it ourselves. We got we got the spires. Oh Q Q Q Q Q Q Q Q Q Ah! 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 Come on! Ah. I was not expecting that. Give me a Clementine! God, put it in. There we go, that should that should hold for a little bit. God no! Hit him with it! Hit him in the head! We gotta pick one. We gotta pick Carly. Even though Doug's nice. And we gotta we gotta help her. She has weapon control. Doug's a little awkward. I feel like Doug wouldn't understand things. I like Carly more, even though Doug's a sweetheart. See we just watch. We just let things happen. Like yeah, we're helping someone. We're just like Oh yeah! Like, you Let's can't go. do that! Uh, let me save Carly, though, because Carly she knows our secret. They, you yeah. Move. Kick him in the head. Yeah. Curb stop him. Die! Come on, give him again. Summertime, you really gotta learn to hold your own. Come on, run! Run! No! Oh man, I saved your life! I saved your life, old man! Thank you, Kenny. Thank you, buddy. Especially a good friend. Aw, he called it a friend. Right, close that door. Alright, that old man's dead. Uh-uh. Off with his head. We gave him pills. We did everything we could to save that man's life. And he's gonna treat us dirty like that. He's gone. He's dead. Not dealing with him. Not at all. I think we've been here before. Is this the place? I think so. Clementine, you stay away from that thing. Oh, we were moving it. I was like, Clementine, it's coming at you. Old man's dead. Mm -mm. That was so disrespectful. Papa's right in the nose after saving him. Oh man, Clementine, it was so uh, I'm at the motel again, but it's cleared out. Yeah, because we killed all the guys, all the zombies there. So you keep that photo with you. Gunshots! Gunshots! I don't like the gunshots. I don't like the gunshots at all. That's scary. Okay. Hey, Glenn. Hey, how you doing, Glenn? I think I need to go. Go where? Yeah, I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. No. Glenn, we're your friends now, buddy. We're your family, bud. I guess just let him go. God, but he's taking a vehicle from us. We need a vehicle. God, I don't like her either. Oh, family can get out of here. You gotta do what you gotta do. Do what you gotta do. And I gotta do this. Okay. You guys be safe. I respect you, Glenn. I'm gonna miss you, Glenn. I'm gonna miss you, bud. Yeah, it would hurt for him to see that every day, too. That would hurt too much for him to really focus on anything anyway. Okay, what's well, up with this awkward silence? Alright. It'd be really nice to have the vehicle, though. I know we have the truck still, but... You know, a pizza car? Those are, those are hard to come by. <laughs> I like the sign. On the back of the truck, it's just... <laughs> yeah... I, I just, it's just ironic from what's happening. Hey. Thank you. Hey, Kenny. Close call back there. Thanks Thank you, for Kenny. Picking me up. No Thank problem. You, we have to take care of each other. Yeah. Indeed. We do. Hey, about Clementine. What about her? Yeah. Earlier I said there's some stuff out there that might screw up a precious little girl like her. You did. Well, right. I still think that's true. But after what yeah. I saw today, I think between you taking care of her and her taking care of herself, you two are gonna be just fine. Aww. Thanks, Kenny. Aww. You got it. I like Kenny. 
He's a good dude. Did you check the glove box? He's a good dude. Katja, how you doing? I guess you're fine. I'm gonna go over here. Hi, Carly. How are you doing? I just saved your life, by the way. I'm not sure if I mentioned that, but I saved your life. How you doing, Carly? I'm okay. You know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? Well, so. we could, but we just watched know, you shoot the guy for no reason. We just met, and he was such a... It's just that I think that I liked him. Oh. I'm sorry, Carl. It's okay. Thanks, though. There's been a lot of death in the past few days. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. Okay. You do. You take time as you need. Wait. Lee? Yeah? What's up? What is it? Say thank you. How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. Yeah. I was gonna help you both. But you helped me first. Yeah, I did. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Yeah, sometimes you just don't know why you make the decisions on the fly. Like... Yeah, sure, I decided for it, just because, I mean, she's a better help, and also, I don't know, I feel like the emotional connection between us and Carly is a lot better, whereas Doug, he was still trying to get used to us, so, I mean, that's kind of why I went with it, but, like, in the moment for him, you never really know why you make these decisions. Screw you, old man, I don't like you. You can go away. I hope you get eaten next. Hey, Duck, uh, you wanna cool it for a minute? Yeah, Duck, chill out! Shut up, Duck! Stupid duck. I'm sorry, there's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's... I got grabbed again. Oh. I was there, though. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Oh. Glenn had the other one. Did you check the glove box? Oh, I'm sorry. It was Thanks. sentimental for her. I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense. But it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Yeah, it's okay. It doesn't matter if it's Lee, broken. Come here for a second. Hmm. Let me go deal with this. Oh, man. Yeah. Clementine. Let's go Clementine. deal with that. Okay, hey, Duck, leave her alone. You like my daughter? Yeah, she's great. Well, stay the fuck away from her. Or what? Or, uh, everyone will know that you, Lee Everett, are a killer. And you were before it was something you had to do to stay alive. Okay. Okay. I know who you are. And I don't cool. give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. I kind of see where he's coming from, but also, hey, calm please? yourself. We've done so much for you already. I, hey, yeah, you want to kiss real quick? Not because I'm into you or anything, but My like... My dad would be dead if it weren't you know. for you. Yeah, you know? That guy it's okay. Because <laughs> of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. Only one man, you know? Only one We're lucky macho man, you know? I, I'm sorry, it's okay. I can't do everything, you know, but... I hope that's the I'm sound sure. of us winning this thing. <laughs> just fireworks. This motor in's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. Something I tells me that's not gonna work out. That plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and yeah. most importantly, we got light. They're worse places to call home. That is true. Yeah, I mean, you right. block off right in you here. Guys, yeah. I think it's going to be okay. I don't know about that one. That's not what I know about. Oh, look, the lights just happen to go off. Whoa, we were just talking about how nice it was to have lights, weren't we? That's crazy. That's that's bonkers, even. Whoa. Whoa. Next time on The Walking Dead. Oh, kick up the ramp. I thought we'd be fine if we kick survived it. the walkers. Never expected they'd stop us out. Oh, there you go. Oh, that was a terrible kick. I want you to Poor have effort. this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. I have all the. Where'd you get that bar? How you doing, Clementine? I have them all. I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food. I got like five of them. Soon. Howdy, I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. 
I never did thank you for saving Duck from the walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The walkers war. don't worry as much as the bandits. all happening next episode? I feel like it's spoiling a lot. Oh, look, a shaggy! Alright. I guess that's what we have to look forward to. Starved for help. Alright, I guess that's the next episode. Shoot. So we just got there and the lights go out. And that's kind of the end of that one. All right. Lied to Herschel. You and 46% of players lied. Did I lie to Herschel? Which was Herschel? Was that? I don't know. Duck or Sean? 52% chose Duck. Yeah, because it's a kid and it's hard not to pick a kid, really. 54% uh, of players defended Kenny. I thought a lot more people would have defended Kenny. Just because Kenny has been helpful to us so far. If you save Duck, you might as well save Kenny. Kenny was kind of in the right. I mean, he was kind of like, hey, back off. It's my kid. Give it a second. Let's see. So I respect that. Uh, gave Irene the gun. Uh, you and 53% of players chose to g refuse to give her the gun. Yeah, why well, would you give her the gun? I mean, if... and would you say Doug or Carly? I was in the less there. I was in the minority there. Technically, I mean, by what? 1% technically. But really, I thought more people would say Carly just because she's good with the gun, you know. Even though that doesn't really matter as much because you don't want to use guns, you know? I don't know. That was a good episode, though. I wish it ended on a more climactic note, though. I mean, just besides the lights going out. Because, yeah, it's kind of resolved. We found a place to stay. And technically, if you never played anything else and didn't watch that little last cutscene, you can end the game there and really just not worry about what happens next. You would never feel like, oh, God, there's such unresolved stuff. Like, you could end there and be like, okay, yeah, that's a good story. We found a way out. So, I don't know. It was really good, though. I really did enjoy that one, and I'm going to keep playing the rest of them because, you know, I really like games like this where I just get to sit back, watch, and think a little bit. I really do like it. But I really did have a good time playing this game, and I hope you guys have enjoyed this first episode or chapter of this game. If you guys did, please make sure to leave a like and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And go ahead and ring that bell. That bell will notify you of when I post next. But thank you guys so much for watching, and have fun, and stay safe.